from the group artistically. He's been praised for his visuals, both as a musician and as an actor in many popular K-dramas. What? He He's in a K-drama? Somebody, if you know what K-drama is, then let me know, because I haven't really been into K-dramas. Um, that's another thing I've shied away from, and now I'm all in. I'm going to be doing some reactions to K-dramas, too. Let's do this. Let's go. Play the guitar and piano as a hobby, and is an avid reader. Jin Young is known as the savage member of the group. His judgmental face and side eyes speak a thousand words. <laughs> when Agassiz show him affection and finger hearts, he's often seen dodging or flicking their gestures of affection away. When he's not playfully torturing Agassiz, he's charming them with his signature grandpa dance. While the other members treat Agassiz as baby birds or powerful phoenixes, Jin Yang has compared them to the shoe bills after hearing their powerful fan chants. <laughs> Though he may seem quiet at first, his playful nature when he taunts his members combined with his charm and versatility in his music and acting endears him to his fans across the world. <laughs> Choi Young Jae always had a passion for music. He hoped to use it as a therapy for others, so he attended a music academy. He joined JYP and after only seven months of training, debuted with GOT7 as their main vocalist. Young Jay writes music for GOT7 and for his own SoundCloud. He's often referred to as Sunshine for his energetic personality and bright yeah, smile. I'm starting to recognize, I recognize. He plays the piano and his habit of singing anywhere and everywhere always brings a smile to others. <laughs> His signature laugh is contagious. Young <laughs> 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 Jay isn't picky about food, but he is allergic to cucumbers and melons. He will avoid them at all costs. Cucumbers and melons. <laughs> Dude, you know what? I can't, I can't handle some of the melons or something. There's like this thing in my throat. I stopped eating them. I mean, I don't really eat any of the melons anymore. I used to eat watermelon when I was younger, but man, I, I'm just staying away from melons. Ooh, that's funny. No, I don't like it. Hey, yeah. Young Jay is never. Oh, is that my dog? I'm trying to get outside. He's crying. Ah, one second, guys. My dogs are making noise. Probably y'all can hear it. And be like, what are you doing, man? Why are you hitting your dog now? He wants to go outside. You better stay outside. Keep running my video. For those of you who've been watching me, you know I have my little, my brother's little dog. Y'all haven't even seen him. He's still a mystery to y'all. I'll show y'all later. I just don't want him to take over the show. He'll steal the, he'll steal the thunder. He's afraid to be upfront, and he stands up for what he believes in. This is visible in his music, especially in his cover of Foreman's You Who I Love. A song by Lee Da Woon, one of the high school students that passed away in the Shaw Wolf Ferry tragedy. Young Jay is dedicated to remembering and honoring this every year. His what? heart is one of the. Young Jay is never afraid to be upfront, and he stands up for what he believes in. This is visible in his music, especially in his cover of Foreman's "You Who I Love," a song by Lee Da Woon, one of the high school students that passed away in the Shaw Wolf Ferry tragedy. Young Jay is dedicated to remembering and honoring this every year. His heart is one of the many reasons that his fans adore him. Kankamuk Buwaku Bam Bam wanted to join JYP since it was the same company of another artist who inspired him in his early childhood. Bam Bam became a trainee at the young age of 13 and later debuted as the lead rapper and lead dancer at Got 7. Bam Bam's love for fashion and confidence have made him someone who's not afraid to break yeah. stereotypes okay, and he's bad, used his social influence to help and defend the rights and freedoms of others by supporting human rights organizations. Bam Bam was born and raised in Bangkok, Thailand and can speak Thai, English, and Korean fluently. Bam Bam has a passion for photography, as well as filming and creating movies. He uses them to show the world as he sees it, through calming aesthetic imagery. Bam Bam enjoys the young and rich lifestyle, is uninhibited, and expresses himself freely. <laughs> I just slain your DM. 
<laughs> His freedom sets a relaxing tone for the group. While Kim Yo-gyum has loved music since elementary school, he became inspired to dance professionally in middle school after trying to imitate choreography. He was scouted at his cousin's dance academy by a JYP trainee instructor, and finally debuted as the main dancer and lead vocalist of Scott Southern. Yugium is extremely kind, sometimes bashful, and always compassionate. When he dances, his confidence dominates the stage, as it did when he won an idol's dance competition, hit the stage in 2016. Wow, you won a dance competition? Although he's the Makne, or the youngest member, Yugium is the tallest member of Scott Southern. Okay, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to These guys look like a lot of fun, man. And with his quirky, bright, carefree personality, he always brings up everyone's mood. Yugim finds comfort in his members' continuous support. His passion for music and dance drive him. In 2019, he debuted as the unit leader of the duo Just Two, composed of himself and JB. Yugim's drive, positive attitude, and eagerness to please make him an invincible member of the group. Yeah, Since debut, they have not only shown their dedication and commitment to their fans, but also to the development and creativity of their music. A feat which has earned them many prestigious awards, both in Korea and internationally, in countries such as Japan, China, Thailand, and the United States. They've been globally recognized with awards such as the Best Worldwide Act and Best Worldwide Influencer Awards from the MTV Europe Music Awards. They are winners of the Korean Asian Artist Award, Global Artist Top 10, Gaon Chart Album of the Year, How You Artist of the Year, Album Bonsang Awards, Multiple Eminent Awards, Soul Music Awards, and more recently the K-Pop Artist of the Year, as well as the Beisang Best Performance of the Year Award. They have also featured on several Billboard charts, including being the first K-pop group to feature in both the Artist 100 and the Hot Tour list while selling out entire stadiums. Not only are they passionate about their music and their fans, they're passionate about giving back to the community. They have donated to many worthwhile charities and causes, including the Australian Wildlife Relief and the victims of the Sokcho Fire. Above all, they continue winning over the hearts of their fans worldwide. Agase is one of the largest groups in K-pop. Agase's with their green agabongs make up the green galaxy. In 2020, Agase's extended their galaxy into the celestial bodies by naming the entire galaxy after GOT7. Oh my goodness. To Agase, GOT7 not only represents seven shining stars, but rather their own galaxy that fills the world with hope, love, and wonder. About to cry. Tearing up because uh, the world needs hope. The world needs light, light like this. The world could be a dark place. And these guys, these guys are like stars shining in the darkness, bringing hope, bringing laughter, man. Making the world a better place. That's what it's all about. Thank you. Thank you for showing me this. Oh. Ah, man. These guys are amazing. I don't know about y'all, but after seeing that, I just feel a whole lot better. Like my life just feels like it just went, just got upgraded. 
All right, man. Uh, I want to thank you guys, those of you that have supported my channel. Jump down here with your amazing comments. Um, I appreciate y'all for helping me on this journey. This is by far uh, something I wasn't expecting when I started this channel at all. I mean, if you see my channel, my how I started it, who I started it with, and then just um, just going all through this whole journey, this has been amazing. Um, so I just want to thank you all for your support. Uh, if you like my channel, um, click, subscribe, comment. I'm an aspiring artist myself to the piano. Check out my music. Hope that uh, I hope to join this uh, movement myself, make the world a better place. And hopefully I can start writing some of my stuff again. You know, I started believing in myself again recently. I was giving up. I was kind of giving up on my own dreams. And uh, it's stuff like this, artists like this that change the world. I mean, and you'll see it was an artist that changed me, that got me to start this channel. Um, and there's nothing more motivating than something very artistic. I mean, if we're just working for money, money can be meaningless. It's what you, it's what you do with it, right? But, uh, man, to see art forms like this, to see art, that's a driver, man. That's like a, it's, it's a whole other way of living. I know these guys work hard too. That's pretty awesome. That's inspiring as well. So those are my comments for now. I look forward to hearing some more stuff from God Seven. This is dude, from what I'm hearing, are you guys saying they're they the group has ended? Because it's now different or they've all broken into I don't know. That's what I'm just now catching up the stuff. So this is uh well this was as of twenty twenty, so wait, someone said they're still gone. I think. Jackson goes, he has his own thing, and who knows if some of these other guys that I'm going to start tracking. Subscribe. Subscribe to this. Give me some more news. I'm going to keep in the loop with this for sure. All right, guys. We'll see you around. Thanks for watching. This is going to probably be a two-part video. Uh, if you made it through that, appreciate you. All right, guys. We'll see you on the next one. Nothing but love for y'all.